What is up guys, welcome back to a new video here on the channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to install mods on Blade or 4, Blade and Sorcery. Um, there is so many amazing mods, fun mods. There, uh, yeah, you can go and scroll around. So go to the link in my description to nexusmods.com slash blade and sorcery and just browse around. But let's say you know what kind of mod you have. You go to the search bar and you type. So for an example, let's say you want a lightsaber mod. You search for saber. But if at the time of this video being out, um, try or test searching for the outer rim. Um, if you want um, lightsabers. Because at the time of recording this, 18th November, uh, 2021 the outer rim does not have um, is it is not out for the update update 10 um, it should be done soon though no idea why it's taking really long you can read, read through here articles or five no 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 posts here or for uh, there's a lot of people that are asking you can currently use it for um, well you can't uh, currently use it for update number 10 or update 10 or u10 or whatever you want to call it it doesn't work sadly enough um but if it does work try it out at the time you're seeing this video because this is the best star wars mod it has i don't know how many lightsabers how many blasters it adds maps it adds enemies like waves and like you can just see from the pictures like you can see you can battle battle like people in the forest and like you see here Camino um Naboo uh, Mos Eisley like Tatooine and a bunch of other maps too I think like you see these lightsabers look so freaking good um uh, but this is for version 1 so they look even better now like you see here it, it's crazy you see this is for version one pictures um that's just amazing and there's like two-sided lightsabers so try downloading this first because this is the best one but if you just want lightsabers maybe not but um then you can install the no 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 this is an expansion i don't remember what m the one i found before um here lightsaber pack u10 this mod you can get for now these ones are actually glowing better but um go and download this one if uh, the outer rim isn't out for u10 yet so i'm going to show you guys how to install it so just press download manual for everything um you just press download manual and then slow download or if there's multiple files you just select the one on top because that's usually the newest one um but yeah then it will download a zip folder the, it is the same kind of installation for almost everything except there is like here thor's hammer that's one for 8.33 uh, because i did find one but some mods have have requirements. So let's take this one, Mjolnir for U10. So now when I press download, it will come up requirements. Then you will need to install these one as well. These are for U9 apparently, but I think they will work for U10 as well. Um, and here there's some like problem solving and stuff. But I'm going to show you guys how to install it. So the developers of Blade and Sorcery have made it easy very easy so just go to your file or your game folder go to blade and sorcery data and then streaming assets and then this is actually here once you get the game it is here from the start the mods folder it is empty or it only has a readme and here it says mod folders can be dropped here find mods here or you can join there or you can go to the reddit there isn't very much mods there 
but in the Discord, you can paste this into Google. They have a bit of mods there, you can say. Or they have like, I guess they re you can recommend mods. You see here, Nexus mods. Um, you see here. Uh, the post, this is a bot that posts the latest mods. You can scroll around here, see if there's anything that you're interested in. Or something like that. But yeah, so you might, uh, yeah, this is actually the one I have. Um, so you want to take the folder, make sure it's not um, deeper than one folder. So you see here, it's um, only this folder and then all the item and actual files come in. So you want to drag and drop this into the mods folder. I'm not going to do it because I obviously already have it there. Um, but yeah. Then you can go ahead and launch a game. There isn't anything else that you need to launch. Obviously, for some games, there is obviously hooks you gotta launch, not here. Um, I will actually see you guys in game, so you don't have to wait. So once you're in game, obviously, you just want to go into the arena, or no, you don't need to go into the arena, or whatever map or something in that map section here when you press F5 and or the level if you have um, if the outer rim mod is actually updated you will be able to choose Star Wars maps there um, but now if you go to the book you can see here it has added sabers some things for an example I have a Captain America shield um, they appear in already categories that's already existing but now if i go to sabers you'll see here i can spawn different lightsabers but i do not have a vr headset so i can't really showcase them although they are very very cool um and yeah you might be under wondering why i have side quests steam vr blade and sorcery oculus and stuff like that um and i also have job simulator uh and that's because I'm planning on getting one pretty soon, so that's why. And I don't want to wait on installing all of these programs once I have the actual headset. Obviously, like, you want to be as prepared as possible. Like, it's not fun to first you wait for the headset and then you have to. And then you also need to wait on installing all of the pro programs that you will need. So that's why I have installed them right now. Uh, but yeah, the VR content might be on the way. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. 